just finished writing my journal and I practiced gratitude this morning and I definitely recommend practicing gratitude whether it be like writing in a journal and like writing things that you're grateful for or just going out in nature and just like saying it in your head and being grateful for every little thing that comes into your way because I feel like when you practice gratitude right in the morning with no distractions you can just start the day way better and more things come your way that are positive that are good and I'll have the video that I used linked down below. I've been trying to focus on my back recently because my scoliosis is kind of like getting bad and I used to go to physical therapy for it but I just stopped going and I feel like it's gotten worse. Like it just feels really bad. Yeah, I found this scoliosis back yoga exercise so I definitely recommend it. It also works with like just feeling gratitude. I felt so good and like it's like meditating basically. I just felt so good in the present moment so yeah, I definitely recommend it. Also, I'm drinking this green drink. I got it from Milani. They actually sent it to me and it was just sitting in the cabinet. I was like, why not try it? Because my dad loves it. It gives you an energy boost and then it also helps with the immune system and also supports like gut health. So that's really good and it's really good to drink this in the morning. So I'm gonna try to like order another one because it's like literally done. Like I had barely a scoop to put in. while ago but i just found it in my drawer this cute romper which is from aritzia and i have like four different colors which i have like this light pink one and it's the one that i got most complimented on because it's like a light pink and it gives off like the pink pilates princess type of vibe and everyone has just been asking me like where did you get it from so yeah it's from aritzia it literally fits like a glove and it's so comfy anyways right now i'm gonna do my makeup because i haven't done makeup in two days since i kind of got burned i don't know if you guys can tell but i got a tan and i'm so happy that i got to go to the beach and tan Literally in my last video I was saying how like pale I looked and I'm finally like tan But I feel like I need a break from the beach because I'm literally peeling like it's really bad I will literally spend like an hour peeling my skin which is so bad Like I know it's bad for your skin but I just keep doing it because it's like addicting for some reason But anyways I got this in the mail today so I just want to open it with you guys I bought hoop earrings from like Target and I absolutely didn't like them They were $24 and they broke I don't know if you guys can tell but right now I have just a normal diamond earring on my second piercing because my other hoop earring which is like this one on my second piercing fell off at the beach and it was literally just not sitting in my ear like correctly like it wouldn't attach it i don't know how to explain it but it was just too expensive for what it was so how do you even open it? but oh my gosh these literally see these are way better okay i'm actually excited to put these on because these look like good quality earrings i want to get my third piercing done on my ear like like my second piercing but like on my third i feel like i got a lot but i definitely want more it literally attaches so quickly like most of these hoop earrings that I buy from Target are so bad. My second piercing was literally closing up because I didn't have a second piercing on for like a week and then it closed up but there was like a small part of like that hole that wasn't closed up so I was so grateful because I kept trying to put it through even though like it hurt so badly. Oh my god. Okay. This is really cute. I will have them linked down below. Hopefully they last. As recently I've been thinking about switching my vanity and putting it on the other side of my room because there's sun hitting in my room and so the background literally gets all white and it just looks weird that's why i'm thinking about putting my vanity on that side of my room and i moved my mirror to take mirror pictures so that's why it's like over there usually it's like over here and there's nothing over here which is kind of weird i wanted to give you guys like a little update on mel so basically a lot of you guys commented on my video saying that mel doesn't stand for money but in portuguese since like i'm brazilian if you guys didn't know i'm brazilian i speak portuguese so that's why my mom came up with mel because in portuguese that's what honey means let me know what you guys' favorite 
concealer is because I need suggestions. I'm kind of like lost on what to get. I used to use the NYX one, but I kind of ran out of it. So I've just been wanting to try different things. I just recently got this in the mail and it's by Fenty Beauty. They sent this velvet liquid lipstick collection and it's literally so pretty. Like the colors are just all dark and I am obsessed. Like imagine this like for a date night and the packaging, adorable. I get so excited whenever they send something because literally like this foundation, for example, this is like my favorite foundation. It's the Pro Filter one and this is like amazing. The only issue is that right now it just doesn't match my skin tone so it kind of looks off. Anyways, I'm going to keep doing my makeup because I have no clue on what to talk about. Okay, I finished getting ready like an hour ago. I've just been on my phone, on my bed, but I need to get up. So, first things first, I want to just kind of clean up my room, but I just want to speak about the sunlight that hits my room during sunset hour. I feel like the camera doesn't do justice, but I have been loving my bed like on this side of the room just because of like the green on this window and then just the sunlight hitting this plant and my nightstand and all of that. Like I've just been obsessed with it. I definitely recommend like switching up your room once in a while if you feel like you're just like getting bored with anything, like just having like a little switch up on life you know just to switch up my room is like not even that messy it just needs a little bit of cleaning to do Right now I'm at a little park with Bella and we're gonna walk a little bit because I've been wanting to do this and I did it on like my 5 a.m. video but I haven't done it in a while so I kind of just want to so I kind of just want to walk on this trail during sunset I usually walk during sunrise and it's just so pretty but I know that sunset today is gonna be really pretty too so we're just gonna walk a little bit go on a different little trail also Bella's still here she's still alive she's literally my favorite dog ever <laughs> she don't like me let's go it's kind of getting hot also here's the fit I'm wearing the shorts with a jacket just to top it off because I I feel naked just wearing just the romper. So we're wearing it with the jacket. showering and I feel so good right now like I felt like so gross because whenever I go out into nature or just like for a walk I feel like I tend to get sweaty obviously but I feel like I smell like nature like the outside so I took a shower and I feel so much better and now I'm just gonna take care of my skin do an eye mask because I haven't done an eye mask in a while like I do face mask but I don't do eye mask and I have like two sitting in my fridge so I'm gonna do an eye mask I literally thought my makeup was gonna look bad today but I feel like it looked good and I don't even want to take it off because that's how good it looks. Okay, so remove my makeup and I'm gonna use this cleansing water. This is what I use always to remove my makeup. Got two different types of eye mask. I got this one. This is the Nitro Hydro Gel Eye Mask. And then this one is the Eye Bright. I think I'm gonna go with the other one. <laughs> Like so refreshing. I like this one because it doesn't like keep falling off. I don't know how to explain it. Like most fall off my face. Like they don't stay on my face. If that makes any sense. Just a casual, casual Thursday. Day. I want to update you guys on some things. So a lot of you guys were asking me like, do I have school and all that stuff. Like I finished school a year ago, like last year at the end of the year. So I didn't really like update you guys, but I did finish it. I did online to like catch up and like finish earlier. And I already explained this to you guys, like why I decided to do homeschool. But I just think it was better in the program. I was using was so good because you could go at your own pace you can do it at any time there's no teacher telling you to do this or that like you can finish it at your own pace it, you could literally finish it in like about a month I finished like four or five classes in a month I just think that program is good for people that do not like going to school like I'm talking about like having friends and stuff like I struggled with that for the past like year it was really hard for me also managing time with like YouTube and school everything was just like really hard on me so for my senior year I just decided to do homeschool and I literally finished it 
so fast. The program I use is James Madison High School. So if you guys are interested in it, I know I told you guys that I would tell you guys when I'm like done with school. So I'll have it on the screen here. That's what it's called. And I definitely recommend it. It's really good. It's kind of like confusing at first on like using it and stuff. But once you get the hang of it, it's literally so easy and you can finish it in a matter of like two months if you really dedicate your time to it. Another update is here's Mel. She has been a little, little mess messy girl she's tired right now because she played with bella like a lot so i'm gonna take care of her skin actually right now i'm gonna do her night routine real quick it's usually just brushing also another thing that i do is i put this eye powder thing for her tear stain because there's obviously like a red tear stain on her eye so i do that every night and it's like very wet. like i didn't think the tear stains like the stains or i didn't think they were like actually wet until like her so i learned and i bought this thing i'll use it every night and every morning on her and i'll have it linked down below if you guys want to go check it out it's really good and i also bought the brush with it but i just use my finger because she just cannot stay still when it's with the brush another thing about her is that she sheds a lot so i make sure to brush her hair because i will literally find fur everywhere in my room it's kind of a hassle but like she's literally so cute <laughs> all that fur okay ready okay so all that fur is literally gonna get pushed on the front because i'm using this little button and you just push the button and it goes all the way to the front and i think, and I that's, think that's so that's cool so because it's so much easier take the fur off the brush and then i just grab it all and put it in the trash but yeah i'll definitely have this link down below if you guys want to check it out i just think it's interesting to me because i've never had a dog that sheds bella doesn't shed and she's a shih tzu so she obviously doesn't shed like mel does so this definitely comes in handy and i never had to buy that for bella Literally look at the point where it came to. It wasn't even underneath my eye. That's so embarrassing. I'm gonna end this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe and like this video if you want more videos like this. I love you guys so, so, so much. Let me know what kind of videos you guys wanna see from me more. I feel like I'm being very repetitive, but I that, like literally have no clue what to do. This is literally what my day consists of every single day, like yoga and editing and doing all that stuff. But I try to be as real as I can with you guys. And I hope this somehow motivated anybody that's feeling kind of like down and just struggling a lot with mental health just know that you're not alone because i was literally just struggling like a straight two months and i'm just now like slowly picking myself back up but just know that i'm proud of you if taking baby steps whether that be getting out of bed in the morning or waking up a little bit earlier or making your bed whatever it is i'm so proud of you and just keep going keep pushing because i know that it's hard but even doing those little things when you're struggling is just it's like a big accomplishment so just know that and i want you guys to truly know that and be proud of yourselves because giving yourself validations for your feelings too is also so important and i really hope this video is somehow motivated in anybody that's struggling and yeah i will see you guys in my next video bye guys